Okay, so I have a clip for, from part of my holiday thing. Holiday for my for car with the radar detector. The radar busts the tree down. Yeah, basically when you went to go see the cops, I was deep into the video because the first part was unwrapping presents, figuring out how to use a TV, figuring out how to play a game that I never actually figured out how to play, and then crashing a couple times. That was actually between the video you can see and stuff. But yeah, and we're at the cops basically and that's what this thing's doing. It went very wrong for me because the car decides to be what it does normally is she coolant sprang from your engine and and it's, it's, it's winter so things were always going to go wrong to begin with. So yeah, beginning, it's just that didn't go well basically. Never, Nothing ever goes well when you're speeding and coolant's at going down in your face. Yeah. Yeah. You know, great. Now the problem here is, will the car make it to them? Because I see the guy who's going to scam me, but you know how my car decides, sometimes it just decides I'll blow up. Hey man, wait for it, wait for it. There you go. Keep it up. Keep it up, car. Keep it up. And crash it. Brakes, power. Oh crap! Crap! No! 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 I like when I tried the brake, but the handbrake in this car is really, really bad. It's really bad. You put you put you you push space in, and all it does is just try drifting. This officer up here is very lucky, though. I was very not, though. Of course not. I'm never lucky in this game. No! No! <laughs> Dead. This is less my fault. <laughs> Nothing good comes from when you hear that sound and also the cops being around. Nothing ever comes good from that. Nothing. What was that? Wh why? Why, game? All I wanted to do was pull over. I meant, I meant to pull over. I meant to run him over, but it didn't work out at all. Yeah, do I have some beer? I need some beer for that kind of crash. So yeah, for me, basically, it was just, ah, uh, just, just set up to get the ticket, basically. And, and a couple of killings from a couple of officers. That's, that's, that's normal here. I guess just skip that, actually. It's much easier. Skipping to that part. Much easier. A lot of drinking beer, though. It's a lot of drinking beer. Lots and lots of drinking beer. And, okay, eventually it gets to drive. Yeah, eventually. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Bye. So as not to roll away anymore. Okay. Let's go. Got a gun. Not afraid to use it. So the first thing first, I need to see what the cops in this car have to say about me. Cause I mean, I, I wouldn't know why they thought that I was running when I was on my side. I was slowly killing myself in my own car. Which yeah, this kind of shows right here. I just slid all the way in there. I slid on one wheel. I didn't have two wheels. I saw one wheel. I, cr I started breaking my back there, slid off the road, passed the cop, avoiding running him over, which is, um, I, I, didn't, I didn't mean to. I wanted to kill him, realistically. But no, he slid and made, avoided him. And what you got to say for me today? $3,000. That is definitely not good, right? So let me see. Feeding. 156 kilometers when that guy called me. I swear it was 180, but no. 56 sounds good, too. Which is still big fine. At 100 kilometer zone. Fit the cloud with a stop sign, and I flew off the road, and then also, that's how they went the radar detector. I was right, they are illegal. And I count some. Either way, I count so that I now know when the cops are where the cops are, but still, they're illegal, which, you know, that just means run from them. I'm assuming it doesn't cost that much to actually get to deal with them. But yeah, three thousand dollars for just that alone, plus the million I was trying to get at home. That's our TX name there. Yeah, might as well pay it. Not enough money, I only got a thousand bucks. But go and send to my house, y'all know my address. Y'all sent me a million dollars already. Go see what the old drinking fine's gonna get me. So yeah, basically all that. You only paid three thousand dollars. Never really didn't care about the whole riding on your side part or any of that thing. They just seemed to care about the point that I drove by them on a stop sign and you know, I just started shooting cops. That, that happened later though. That was that was the whole thing later. So yeah. Basically, the radio detector, it, it, it basically helps you find out when there's cops nearby. Problem is, you have to really want to stop or actually do it, otherwise you're just going to end up crashing. Especially trying to put your handbrake on. That that was my downfall. 
basically, listen, don't put your handbrake on the winter. Especially going 100 kilometers over, basically. That's what speed I'm on the car said, 200. They say 150, I say 200. So, yeah, let me describe more. It was, just, the other cop really didn't care what I had to say. He didn't really care at all. It was only those two. He might just end up shooting. So, yeah. Yeah, that's how most of the days go. Most things in this town go that way. That's just felt so game news. Yeah. Back later. Well, down to it. Yeah, I got something to say. What you got to say about it, huh? You blacked out sun shades in the middle of winter? Who are shades in the winter, huh? Who are shades? They're not like the glasses, they're shades. Yeah, that's not good. So, so what you gotta say, dummy, dumb, dummy, dumb. That's fine. Say what I get. Okay, take the fine. Very to bad, big police officer. <laughs> Fifteen cents. See, if y'all give me a thousand dollar fine, it'd be good. I could, I could actually pay you. But no, you don't know how to give me a thousand dollar fine. So, I guess we have to deal with you the hard way. And well, yeah. He shot himself. It was, it was suicide. Yep. So I will go and I'm gonna walk away. So yeah, basically that's what the radar buster does. It warns you when cops are around. If you don't know when they're around, and if you do know when they're around, at least you know when but where. Because I thought they'd be back there by uh by the mansion, but no, they got to be all the way down the middle of the woods.